what is going on YouTube it's a boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'll be showing you how to install custom cold boot on your HFW hand exploited PS3 okay so let's go ahead and get started first thing you want to do guys is go to your hand toolbox then you want to enable hand enabler right here offline press X okay so hand was enabled now go back to the hand toolbox go down to external content go to cold boot downloader then you can go ahead and download whichever one of these cold boots you need okay so I'm just gonna let's see I'm gonna do this one right here the rebug one so I'm gonna press X press X again it's gonna ask you press yes let it download install and that's it now what you need to do exit your hand toolbox go over to internet browser press X once you're on your internet browser you should have a blank page I've showed you guys how to make this so go ahead and press start on your controller delete this that's it ps3exploit.com press start launch the page press ok then you wanna go up to the v3 tools right here go down to 4.84 hfw go over to extra tool cold boot run this tool press x press x again press x make sure that you're using the hfw 4.82.2 a um, hand exploit okay make sure that you're using it alright so once you're on this page press triangle go down to bookmarks and my bookmark press X and bookmark it press circle press circle again exit the browser press X one more time and enter the browser again when you're in the browser now you wanna press the select button on your controller here is the bookmark press X press X again and we get back to this page doing this method will make it works a lot faster so you want to go up to the part where it says USB 000 press X go all the way down to the last one that says dev hdd0 slash game slash hand toolbox users press X and you want to select that the last one let me do that again press X right there and you want to make sure that you select the last one okay press X go down to initialize cold boot installer press X once you get cold boot installer initialized successfully go over to launch cold boot initialization press X and this will reboot your PS3 so that's it guys if you like the video please give it a thumbs up also share the video around and also you guys can subscribe for more video to come thank you all for watching and i will see you guys in my next video